Hi friends, welcome to my channel Simplify Your Schooling. Today's topic of Maths Tutorial Series of Class 4 is Addition. The numbers which are added in addition problem are called addends and the result is called the sum. Suppose 20 plus 15 is equal to 35. So the number 20 and 15 are addends here, are addends and the answer 35 is the sum. Now let's see the properties of addition. Property 1. Order property of addition. Changing the order of the addend does not change the sum. That is 54 plus 31 is same as 31 plus 54. So 54 plus 31 is 85 and 31 plus 54 is also 85. Property 2. Property of 0. When 0 is added to any number, the sum is the number itself. 22 plus 0 is equal to 22. Here 0 is added to 22. So 22 plus 0 is the number itself 22. Property 3. Property of 1. Sum of any number plus 1 is the successor of that number. 16 plus 1 is equal to 17. So when 1 is added to 16, the answer is 17. And 17 is the successor of 16. Property 4. Grouping of addends. When three or more numbers are added, the sum remains same regardless of the way of grouping. Suppose 12 plus 18 plus 30 is same as 12 plus 18 plus 30. Here, first we'll solve the numbers which are written in brackets. So 12 plus 18 is 30. Now, this number 30. 30 plus 30 is 60. And in this case, first we'll solve the bracket. 18 plus 30 is 48. 12 as it is now. 12 plus 48 is 60. So the grouping of the addend doesn't make any difference in the sum. Now let's see some questions on addition. 3968 plus 395. So First, we'll check the place value of all the digits 1s, 10s, 100, and 1000. Here, 1s, 10s, 100. So, how we do the addition? 1s, 10s, 100, 1000. Here, number is 3, 9, 6, 8, and here it is 395. Now, we do the addition. 5 plus 8 plus 5 is 13. Carry 1 here. 9 plus 1, 10 plus 6 is 16, carry 1. 9 plus 1, 10 plus 3, 13 and 1 carry here. So 3 plus 1, 4. So the sum of 3, 9, 6, 8 and 395 is 4,363. Now let's take Another question, find the sum of the smallest 5-digit number and largest 4-digit number. As we all know, the smallest 5-digit smallest number is 10000. So, this is the smallest 5-digit number and the largest 4-digit number is 9999. Now, we will do the addition. 10000 plus 9999 nine, 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 nine. is 19,999. So it is 19,999. Let's take one more question. Estimate the answer by rounding off the numbers to nearest 100. So the first number is this one, 83462. So we have to round off this number to the nearest 100. So 4 is the here rounding number. And as we know the rule of rounding number, if the digit just right to the rounding number is from 0 to 4, then keep the rounding number as it is and change all the digits to 0. And if it is from 5 to 9, then add 1 to the rounding number. So 4 is the rounding number here and the digit just right of it is 6, which is from 5 to 9. Then rounding number will change to 5. We will do 
we will add 1 to the rounding number. So it is 5, 0, 0, 8, 3. So 8, 3, 4, 6, 2 is rounded off to 8, 3, 5, double, 0. Let's take one another number 7, 6, 3, 4, 9. Here we have to round off to the nearest 100. So 3 is the rounding number and digit just right of it is 4 from 0 to 4. So rounding number will remain as it is and all rest right side digit to 0. 7, 6, 3, 0, 0. So, so now so these number number one and number two first we have rounded off to the nearest hundred so this is the answer of the uh, this is the answer after rounding off the digits now we have to do the addition so eight three five double zero plus seven six three double zero now we do the addition zero zero four 5 plus 3 8, 6 plus 3 9, 8 plus 7 is 15. So this is 1,59,800. So here first we have seen what is addition, what are addends, the number which are added are called addends and the product and the answer we got is the sum. Now we have seen the properties of addition, changing the order of the addend does not change the sum property of 0 if 0 is added the sum remains the uh, the sum is the number itself property of 1 if 1 is added to any number then the sum is the successor of that number grouping of the addend grouping of the addend does not make any difference in the sum and then we have seen some questions how to do addition and some variety of other questions like uh, some of the smallest five digit number largest four digit number how to do that and the addition with the rounding off we have seen. I hope the addition topic is completely clear to you. Thanks for watching my video. Do subscribe my channel. Simplify your schooling. Thank you.